how to return a string value from a bash function or how to declare a function or call a function these all are covered in this tutorial so first we will uh, see the simple use of function and next we will see how a function can return a value in bash string the first example is about using global variables so uh, we will create a script with this code using global variable I first I will set the script font one dot bash here uh, the red value is a global variable and when uh, you access this uh, variable from the function then it is also act as a global variable not a local variable that we and if you want to define a local variable for the function then there is another way i will show you in the next example so uh, here red value is first assigned i hate programming and which is printed when you call the function then it will overwrite the value of this global variable red cell and then the value of red cell will be I like program. So if I run the script bash on one dot bash then uh, you can see first printed I had programming which is the value of this global variable. And after calling the function, the value is overridden by I like programming. So, in the next example, uh, using function command and how to use local variable in bash script. Uh, this example will show this. So, in F2 function, uh, here a global a local variable is declared using local keyword that means this value is only accessible inside the function and the value is using bash function and which is printed here a uh, function is called uh, using like this uh, which is called function command and uh, uh, it will uh, receive the return uh, value Return from this function so dollar f2 and it will uh, set a local value and which will be returned to the caller and the caller will get the value in the variable get value and which is printed later so I will set the file on to dot bash and I run the script from here on to well, you can see the output using bash function okay now go for the example 3 using variable uh, in normal standard programming language the argument values are uh, provided with the uh, first bracket of the function but in bash it is different to provide argument. So in front tree, there is a local variable which will store the first argument value and if the argument value is empty then it will print bash function uh, not empty then it will print bash function with variable otherwise it will print no argument. So here get val1 variable and will uh, assign bash function next the if t is called with one argument dollar get val one that is bash function so here dollar one will catch this value bash functions to this variable dollar get val one and it will print bash function with variable so when uh, we print uh, echo get val uh, without local keyword all variable will be act as a global variable so this one is a global variable so if you print it here then it will print bash function with variable here a uh, function is called without any argument or parameter so 
dollar one will be empty and it will print no argument. I will save the file. Three dot bash. And now I will run it. Here yeah, you can see the first output is bash function with variable when it is called with argument and second is no argument. In this way you can send a uh, parameter or argument in bash function. Example 4 using return statement. And this is the last example. Uh, how to return value from a bash function. Uh, return keyword also exists in bash to do the text. This is F4 and it's in the message bash return statement and uh, to return any value you have to uh, set the command return and then uh, the return value. Here F4 is called and to catch the return value uh, the symbol is used dollar question mark. It will uh, store the return value from the function and print. So I will say the file from four dot dash. And if I run the script from four, then you can see the return value of the function is 35 that is returned by this statement. In this way, you can declare a function, you can set uh, argument for the function or you can return any value from a function which I have covered in this future. Thank you.